<laughs> Let's play! Whoa! Say hi to the black screen, everybody. It's our good old buddy. Likes showing up. Always at the very beginning of the stream. It's fine. I think it's because I choose PC capture instead of, like, the display capture. I'm sure it wouldn't be a black screen, but for me, it's easier doing the the PC game capture. Once I get another monitor, like, I, what I want to do is get a brand new desk, have a lot more space, and then I'll have whatever the space needed to have two monitors, or even three, depending on how things go, and do display capture one one of the monitors for the game. Anyway, hello there everybody, welcome to another stream of Celeste. The game where we're climbing up, well, Celeste Mountain. And uh, we're having a lot of fun, it's a hardcore platformer. Uh, looks like it even delves into mental disorders a little bit, from what I can tell. And it portrays it very well, even when uh, Madeline had, or is it, you know, I just had, I had a quick question. Is it Madeline or Madeline? Because I hear both. I've heard both pronunciations before. And I keep switching out my pronunciations. Is it it's Madeline? Okay. Uh, but yeah, she had a panic attack at the end of the last stream. And like, it was portrayed very well. So... We're gonna keep assist mode off. We're doing, we're doing, uh, we're doing well without the assist mode. So here we are. What is this? Uh, oh yeah, chapter five is the Mirror Temple. The name alone is gonna freak me out a little bit because it's like, how bad is this gonna get? Because, well, I'm assuming there's gonna be a bunch of mirrors everywhere. But you know, I think it'll be okay. Did you know? Most climbing mishaps occur due to exhaustion. Remember to take regular breaks. That's a very good point, guys. If you ever feel that's any game you play, you know, take a break. You know, step step away from it, you know. Relax. Oh man, look at this place. Feeling adventurous? Uh, I don't know. It looks pretty dark in there. More like a nightmare than an adventure. I'll just take a quick peek, snap a few photos. This place must be ancient. Theo, wait! My suspicious followers are gonna eat this up! There's no way this ends well. We already know it's not gonna end well, but uh... Whatever. I'm surprised I can go back here. Alright, hold on. I thought I, I legit thought I saw something when I was falling to the right. No? I I know my secrets. <laughs> okay. Cause there, like to me in my head, there's like there's no way they would allow me to go back like that if there wasn't something to do, you know? Oh, <laughs> now once again, I'm loving the music of this game. It, like, really sets the mood. Alright, so these... Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. I I'm liking the... the uh... Wait a minute. I'm liking the idea of the, uh, of this, the gimmick, I should say, of this play so far. Oh, where am I going? Wait, why the hell did I do that? There was nothing else up here, was there? Oh, 
Okay, sorry, I thought I can change the direction of those things. Uh, nope, cannot change the direction. Damn. Now you guys know me. I'm gonna get that I'm gonna get that freaking strawberry. I don't need to, but I want it. Oh, I just realized that I don't have a dash anymore when I do that. How am I supposed to handle that? Or this is wait a minute, I think I got an idea. Yeah, it's gonna be a little hard. But I'm gonna do it, damn it. What happened? Game. Why you're not jumping when I want you to jump? Oh. Why are you not jumping off of the wall? I feel like, hold on, I'm... Yeah. No, oh, crap, well, there goes my dash, though. Ugh. Problem is, is like when I jump straight, I'm, I'm gonna hit the damn thing and. Oh! Oh, well. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? When I finally get it down. Boop! Finally! Okay. that works mm -mm. Uh. well nope No! Mm. Okay, I'm happy with that. Uh <laughs> Okay. Oh, that's right. That wasn't that bad. Uh oh, wait, 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 wait. The idea wasn't bad, it was just, once again, execution. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, Joanne, yeah, the strawberry count was at 69, ha 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 ha. I've ruined it. <laughs> um, I have an idea, is this gonna work? Oh. Yeah, that worked? Oh, that's kinda cool. I can light up the area a little bit by hitting these diamond things, I guess. 
Okay, there's nothing below there. Alright, good to know. Am I supposed to? Okay. Wait, can I hit this? Okay. Okay. Uh... Should have realized that. Not like that. The problem is, is like if I jump again like that. <laughs> uh, hmm, hold on. No, 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 not like that. I gotta aim where it's going to be. Awesome. And why is my feed not showing up when people follow? That is so ridiculous. Come on, Twitch. You're supposed to tell me. Uh, Panina Chan, thank you so much for the follow. I definitely do appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoy your time here. All right, so I just gotta. I'll leave now. Or I can do that and just get out of here easily. Oh, <laughs> it's like, wait a minute, that's not going to work. Oh, come on, go back, go back a little bit. There you go. Bloop. <sighs> what? Okay, here we go. <laughs> here I go, nothing happens. Up. Gotta go up. Oh, no, no, no. Just gotta get that momentum going. Ugh. You know, that went a lot smoother than I thought it was going to. I thought it was gonna take me a lot more times. Uh, let's see. I'll look for just a little bit. I used to watch your Kingdom Hearts videos before. Just so many, just so many YouTuber Twitch streamers to follow. I totally understand, Panina. Um, may I show my channel as well? Sure, go ahead. I'm glad you enjoy the Kingdom Hearts videos. I mean, if you're talking about the old ones, then I, I'm sorry, because those videos are not good. They're old, I should say. I know I dog my, my content a lot, but, uh... They're old videos, and I know that they could be a lot better, but I'm glad that you were watching and enjoying them. And, yeah, totally understand. There's a lot of, um... There's a lot of people follow nowadays, you know? I completely understand that. So, why'd I do that? What was I trying to do there in my life? Now, I want to somehow get up to the top right there, but that's just not going to work. All right. Can I go diagonally with these? Yeah. Ooh, spoopy. Aw, oh, damn it. No problem whatsoever, Panina. We're in a community where we grow from each other, you know? Aha. So, oh, that's, I didn't realize there was one right there. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, that's how I grew and, you know, how else is anyone else going to grow? We don't do the same. So good luck to you as well, buddy. Do I want to go here? Ugh. I hate when there's so many choices to go and I don't, I don't know where I want to go. Seems odd this is just here. Sorry, it just it just seems really odd that that's there. I think I forgot my strawberry. 
And I got crushed. Hello there, Justin. Welcome to the stream. No need to apologize, buddy. We've just been playing for about like 15 minutes or so. And I'm dropping frames, but I'm okay now. You're here at Dragon Con, just waiting for your laptop to finish charging before I walk around. I'll stream a little after I get some grubbins. Once I get back from this con, I'll resume my weekly game streaming. Nice, dude. I hope you enjoy uh, Dragon Con. That's not what I wanted to do, game. Nope. Yeah, that, that's how that's how I do it. Woo. Okay. Yep. No, right. Oh. Not that right. Oh, that that works. That works just fine. Okay. Uh, damn it. Okay, I got. I got. Oh come on! I can't time that right. Oh come on! This game is kind of like Ink. It's a lot more challenging. I don't. I don't think I've ever heard of Ink. But it's like this. I should love it then. Oh, I need to come here anyway. So I know what door that opens, but I would like to see what's up there. I'm playing with a, a controller. Seems easier for me anyway. I have an idea. Let's see if this works. Not like that. I'm too far out. <laughs> I'm keep going too far out. Ooh. No, no, no. Oh. Damn. Panina, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I definitely do appreciate it. That's how you do it. Okay, I think I... Well, I would say I thoroughly investigated what I need to do, but I think I did what I could do. you are <laughs> Madeline hey what the hell uh, why are you inside a mirror I'm pretty sure you're the one in the mirror what happened well I was taking a nonchalant mirror selfie you know it's your boy Theo in this ancient temple no big deal oh my god hashtag blessed next thing I know I wake up lying on the ground what does it look like over there? How can I find you? It's, uh, it's really dark and weird. There's, uh, there, wait, something's coming. I'm feeling a strong inclination to run away. Be careful, okay? What? That's odd. By the way, Pharaoh, since school is back in session, I'll be starting robotics before I'm long. Aside, I would best move your stream to Tuesday. Also, start time for my stream is 5.30 Eastern, but end time is now around 9 p.m. instead of 10.30 p.m. Okay, I hear you. Makes sense. And uh, thank you for whoever hosted. I do apologize. I couldn't see. Did somebody host? How come it's not even showing? What happened there? I heard a noise, but nothing showing up. Why is Twitch and OBS acting funky for me? Panina hosted. Okay, thank you, Panina. Why did it not show on my end? Even even my thing didn't even show it. Whatever, but thank you so much. I really do appreciate all this love and support, man. Really, really do appreciate it. 
Only 13 more bits and I get to I get your 10,000 bit milestone. Oh wow. Do it, Justin. I'm gonna light up this area a little bit. Oh hold on, what's up here? Hell's up there apparently. Just gotta light things up a bit. Okay, here I go. First try. That's how you do it. And thank you again for whoever hosted. I apologize I couldn't see, but I love you all very much for all the love and support. Uh, ooh. Oh, which way? Which way? Which way? This way? Seems like something should be right here. That was nature. Okay. Thank you, nature. Hmm. Alright. Guess it is just the one way to go. Eh. Part of me doesn't like how dark it gets, but at the same time, it is pretty cool how you could... You can make it lighter by... Um... You can make it lighter by hitting those lights. Well, duh. <laughs> make it make light by light. Two, two hosters. Ha ha ha. Ah, is he still on Sesame Street? The freaking count. That's where I'm, I guess that's where I need to go, but I'm doing everything else besides going that direction. What's over here? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Yeah, that breaks easily. Uh, how in the name of fudge am I supposed to get that strawberry, though? Okay, so I gotta remember, I can't dash. And if I dash, the winged strawberry goes away. Ah, oh, well, at the end, I could have dashed there. Actually, wait a minute. Okay, say say I grab it, then what? Like I feel like the area on the left I gotta do something with, but can't I just fall back to the right and I'll be able to get it? See you later, Milo. Thank you so much for coming out, buddy. Uh oh. Whew. Okay. Scary, but I got it. Once again, how the hell did I get that other strawberry? Is it through here? Maybe. Maybe. I didn't hear another host thing go off. Uh, oh, girl, so I don't know. Maybe it didn't go off? Fudge, I'm not gonna do that one. Oh, let's. I gotta think about this one a little bit. No, I mean, I got my. Okay, never mind. A lot easier than I thought. Still don't know how to get that. Unless there's a way on top, but I thought this was the way on top. Uh oh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There it is. 
That's how you do it. It was just dark. Look how, look how this game likes to mess me up. I think I checked out. Wait, what the hell? What was I supposed to do again? Just go up here, right? Alright, I think I did what I need to do. Okay, so we got that. Oops. Ah! Oh wow, hold on a minute. There's a big message there. So, so original was made on Pico 8. I really need to explain what Pico 8 at some point on the stream is. Yeah, because I, I saw, I mean, I noticed like on the game, the mini game, it says like Pico 8. And I'm like, is that like some type of like Intellivision, ColecoVision um, emulator things? I never heard of Pico 8 before. Uh, but yeah, there's that. A fun fact about the count. Did you know that in some versions of the legend, vampires have uh, a rhythmomania? That is to say that they are com compulsed to count things, and is a guaranteed way to escape these forms of vampires is to scatter rice or something similar behind behind you as you're being chased, and they'll be unable to stop themselves from counting the er uh, counting every grain, giving you enough time to flee, and it could in fact be used to keep them in place until the sunrise destroyed them. That's supposed to be ten. Well, thank you, Joanna. For 10 bits. And that's a... That's pretty cool. Pico's a new grass thing, right? No, oh, well, Pico... Wasn't he, like, the mascot of new grounds long ago? Um, but I, I, I guess, according to Sven, that's not what it relates to. Man, where do I want to go? There's a couple places. Let's head to the bottom first, I guess. Oh, man. Oh. Is that why I wanted to go? Hold on. There's so much. All right. It just seemed natural that I, that's what I had to do. Was like jump, jump that huge thing. Newgrass has so many mascots. I thought, yeah, well, at least in my opinion, I thought Pico was meant to be like the de facto one. But you know, it's been ages since I've been on Newgrounds. Is is Newgrounds even a thing still? Like Newgrounds, like Tom Fulp, all those people are. are are they still around? Okay. Uh, this is going to be weird. Like, I have an idea what I need to do, but... Can I jump? No, not like, not like that. Like I was gonna do, can can do like that dash jump out of these things. Oh, now I'm screwed. <laughs> <clears throat> I know that Pico the Guy was the thing, but that's about it. I don't know what it is, but I know it exists. Pico the Guy, oh, that's it's like salsa, basically, right? They still make games. The last one being Pit People. Oh man, I have like I said, I haven't been on Newgrounds in like 15 years, probably. There's no way to preserve a second dash out of a bubble. Damn it. Um. I don't, I don't think I'm doing this right, but... Or... Oh! Oh! 
Oh, screw you, game. I would have had it if I just wasn't so damn quick with the draw. Yeah, I'm not sure if I did that right. Something tells me I, I did that weird. But I got it. That's all I care about. So, I went through here, yeah? Okay. Took a look at that. Nope. Oh. So that opened the door on the bottom, but is that where I want to go, or is there stuff up here I can still do? Uh, let's go to the right. I did do it right? Okay. It just seemed odd that that was supposed to be, like, the solution. It looked like there was supposed to be more to it. Oh, hold on. I, there was a light up there I wanted to take a look at. Or if there was an area up there. There is an area up there. Ha-ha. Can't hide that stuff from me. That's our area up there. Almost seems like there is something I can break up there, but screw it. Method is irrelevant in the successful attainment of a goal in a video game. <laughs> I like that saying. Yeah, it's true. I, I, I got I to gotta just say, I got to, like, you know, just be happy that, listen, you did it. It's fine. Boom. You're good. You know? Okay. How do these things work again? Like, like I know I gotta collect them. Oh, hold on. B side. Like, I know, like, the, the, I gotta collect those three seeds. It gets me a strawberry, but, I, like, is it a time limit? It seems kind of odd. It's a time limit? Okay. Welcome back, uh, Poe Girl. Nope. Wasn't even paying attention there. Oh, that was a lot easier than I thought. It's not a time limit? Oh. Hmm. You girl Gente, so you're full? Oh. Like, yeah, it's weird. Like, hold on. Is it if I land on something? Yeah. Hmm. There you go. So yeah, I, I was saying like, I think it's like when I step on something, boom, that's it. So they reset upon making solid contact with the ground for a few frames. They have the same interaction strawberries do. Okay. Okay, so I think we took care of all that stuff. I went down here, you're right. Yes. And I believe I went there to the bottom left, so all I have left to do is 
go up there. I saw like statues or something. Alright, wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. There is this. Uh, something tells me this is where I'm supposed to go. Ah, <laughs> well, eventually that's where I'm supposed to go. Okay. Not a problem, then. Let's head back. Something tells me there's things up here. Just to mess around. Okay, well. You may have noticed sometimes you don't actually collect strawberries for a while after you grab them. Um, if you very quickly jump off the ground. Uh, yeah, it, like, I was actually wondering about that. It's like, sometimes you, got, you gotta go a certain amount away from the strawberry. Other times they come away, they just instantly pick them up. Yeah, I was a little iffy about that. Okay. I have an idea. Let's see. Not like that entirely. Ah! Oh, almost had it. Just gotta aim right. That's it. Still doing on direct directional jumps, which I don't mean to do. The strawberry that time around. It's one thing or another. Either I pick it up and. No! I pushed down! Not right. I pushed down. But no, I'm. I, I hate. I, I shouldn't blame the game. It, this is my fault. The, the controls are very good with this game, which I, I feel that's why a lot of people love this game. Controls are tight. They work. There you go. It's gotta be precise. It's for a niche achievement involving chaining several strawberries in a row before making solid contact with the ground and actually collecting them. It can be completed in multiple places with varying levels of difficulty. I think it's six on top of your head. Six berries, that is. Holy crap. Seems like it'll be insane to kind of do. Hold on. Something seems weird. No, 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 no. It's where I'm supposed to go, so we're going to hold off. Okay. Can I not just jump out of these? No. Okay, hold on. Oh, why'd I do that? I blame the game. <laughs> okay. Gotta be so precise, but that's what I love about these games. There you go. 
now we can go up here. So it makes it seem like I gotta fall through it. Pick up the uh pick up the nonsense. Oops. Have I played Dust? Uh the Elysian Tale? I have not. Panina. I I may have it. Could be wrong. I thought I had the game actually. Oh no, screw that. Sorry, I thought something had to be in the top left there. I might like it. It looks pretty good. I, I've seen a lot about it. Ah, uh, okay. Why are they giving me that extra jump? Uh, you know, maybe I, I think I was doing it my own method. I think that's why. I skipped the easy path again. Okay, so I wasn't supposed to go di diagonally up. I was supposed to go up and grab... Okay. I was wondering. I was like, that seems weird. Yeah, but it just looks like a game I, I would enjoy. It's so bloody pretty, and the, the Navi-esque character is the most precious. I... You know what? What was funny about Dust is... There were, I think it's made by a group of people whoops, that went to my sister's college, and they even. I'm, I'm kicking, I'm kicking myself in the ass for this. They were looking for voice actors at that time, and they, my sister, she's like, well, I know these guys. She's like, maybe they can help you out or something, and I'm like, oh yeah, sure. But then, I don't, I never received the audition thing they were looking for, but. Oh, well. At least there was a chance I could have been in Dust in Elysian Tale, but that's okay. Alrighty. Okay, that's what I had to do, and then I just gotta shoot to the left. Okay. And there's the key! Yay! Look at the progress, guys. There's the one minor character. It's voiced by a uh, Team Four Star actor. I can never take him seriously. <laughs> I mean, and don't get me wrong. Team Four Star, they're funny as hell, you know. Uh, but I feel like, you know, that's why you got to be careful what you do. As an actor, because it's like, once you're like situated in a certain role, or if you want to say typecasted, then it's very hard to try breaking out of it, because people are only going to think like, well, are you played whoever on, on a parody video? And it's like, oh, well, no, I'm more than that. And it's like, well, that's all they see, unfortunately. Okay. <clears throat> Surprise, I did that my first try. You, do you know what it reminded me of? And I feel like maybe I, I can I can say that this particular game inspired me. Donkey Kong Country. If you guys remember about the barrel blasting out of segments, that's what it reminded me of. I, I, I thank that game for it's all the help. All right, Panina, you enjoyed Dragon Con. And thank you so much for the good luck. Thank you for being here. Thank you for all the love and support. Definitely appreciate it. So Pico 8 is a virtual console. And by that, I mean that it never existed in a, as a real console. Oh. But there's a full specification of what would be size and display, number of colors, cartridge size, and all other stuff. You can put on a 
put on a real hardware. You can put it on a real hardware if you want, like a Raspberry Pi. So to put it simply, Pico 8 is an emulator of the never-existing console created to inspire small but expressive designs. That's pretty damn cool. There's had there had to be things I missed. There had to have been. Oh, what's gonna happen when I do this one? Is Badalin gonna come out of here? Oh, I'm getting sucked into the mirror world. am I looking at? What the hell is that? What the? Why? Why am I this thing now? Hold on. Am I supposed to break that stuff? This, this is weird. Oh, completely unnecessary, but it may be possible to ne neutral jump up there. I don't, I don't remember the game ever teaches you it requires that technique. So doing a neutral jump, I don't think I've ever heard of it. No, it's a very clever teaching moment. Huh. Let's do the time warp again. This is your favorite segment of the game. One of your favorite segments of the game. This is just trippy as fudge. Uh. I'm gonna avoid those things that look. Well, what actually happens if I touch it? Nothing. Okay. Ah! Uh. Now, what the hell's all that about? We Cthulhu now. Oh. Oh no, it's Madeline. I mean, it's Badeline. Hey, where are we? What did you do to Theo? You think I'm doing this? That's cute. Sweetheart, this is exactly what I warned you about. You didn't warn me about Cthulhu BS. Don't try to make this my fault. You still don't give it. The mountain gave me this body. But I'm not the only creepy thing living in that messed up head of yours. Don't like what you see? What a surprise. Shut up. I tried to stop you. Look into the mirror. All of this is yours. This temple only magnifies the mountain's power. You're in control here, not me. I love the music. You know, oh, you know, you know what the music reminds me. Remember that game I played? Was it last year? The Stories Untold. Kind of reminds me about that. Speaking of Stories Untold, I want to play that new game they made called Observation. Maybe one day. By neutral jump, you mean it's possible to climb up walls without using any stamina, stamina with extreme precise inputs. Not a great place or time to explain in further detail, but you just know it's possible. Oh, okay. I gotcha. That would be kind of cool if I knew how to do that. But. I don't believe you. If you're part of me, then why do you want to hurt me? Poor Madeline. Always the victim. All I do is babysit you and you hate me for it. You're unraveling and you know it. If you care so much about protecting me, why didn't you just explain what was going on? Like you would have listened? You never gave me a chance. 
Like, I, I want to say these segments give a more deeper explanation or, like, of a, a psyche of Madeline, but uh, I'm, I don't know. I don't want to make any assumptions yet. Please, just help me get out of here. Now you want me to save you? Why are you doing this? Oh, no, she's going to have a panic attack. Just be on my side here. Please. Stop trying to make me feel like a monster. You really want to know why I won't help? Because you deserve this. Still think you can climb this mountain? Shut up! I don't need your help. I'll do this alone. You know what they say about assumptions. Yep. Yeah. From what I understand the plot, Madeline is Madeline's mental illness. At least she's she's what my mental illness feels like. See, it makes me wonder, like, what I do I want to say if Madeline is her mental illness, or like, is it legit just part of her? You know, like it is a cliche to say in, in all of us we have a good and bad side, you know, like not everybody is pure white or, you know, like, there's no like black and white scenario, or, like like, everybody's in the gray side, if that makes any sense, you know? We're, we're involved, we're, we have many components. Whether it be, like, in, and also, like, in terms of how we think and feel. So, legit, when she says she's part of us, that's legit to me what it is. Like, she is part of us. She is, what she, even the bad side is what makes us whole, if that makes sense. So, your mental illness is a part of you, for better or worse. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm explaining it the way I want to, but, like, yeah. Oh. Wait, hold on a minute. What the hell is I supposed to do here? Oh. I can't touch these, right? Nope. Uh, why did I do that? Mm, can I even go across? Yeah, okay. Ah! Oh. Okay, so I can smack it on its head. And it can also eat me, too, so I gotta be careful. Wait, does, does it go through that stuff? Oh, but he can activate the stuff too. I'm sure there's things I'm missing here, but I'm not too focused on trying not to lose here. Oh! What are those things? I, I, I wish I knew. I really don't know. Oh, so he can break those. Okay. Oh, but he can't go through these. There we go. So it's like a little protective barrier. Okay. But that, that's the whole segment. Oh, that's the whole point of the segment when we played as a little thing. Like he can break through the red blocks but he can't go through the barriers. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Alright. 
think we're okay for now. I'm I'm really liking the music here. I love I love the feel. It's creepy, but I'm just enjoying it still. You can never play this game. I c you can never play this game. You know your limits. <laughs> I'm loving this game so far. It's this is all in my head, and why is it so hostile? These things are haunting me. Hunting me. I'm a trespasser of my own world. Theo is trapped somewhere in here because of me. If I get in fully, maybe the temple will let him, let him go. Breathe. This is all coming from inside me. Get up, Madeline. Think of the feather. You can save Theo. Ow. Nope. Damn it. I should just do what I did before. Uh. It's all this rock candy. It's, it's like forbidden fruit right now. I'm stubborn, but I also have a very short temper and really poor hand-eye coordination. It would make me so angry. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'll rage, but not like to a huge extent. But I like this. It might be worth giving a try with assist mode on. Maybe later I'll try it on. But for myself, I mean, if I can if I can get through this normally, then cool. Um, but for the hell of it, maybe later on after I beat the game, I'll see what uh, assist mode's all about. Hmm, how do I do that part? I need time to look at this. Um... There you go. But, but it's like my problem when it comes to a lot of games like this is like, I just want to go gung-ho into something. I don't even want, I don't want to like really look and see what really needs to be done to, like, you know, figure out the puzzle. I kind of brute force my way through things. That was cool. I, was, I didn't mean for that to happen. I, I just want to check here because, yeah, figures there was stuff I was missing. There's like, hold on a minute here. There's keys, and I well, actually I can't get through here without going with, using the bubble. Interesting. Okay. The ambience of the OST is fantastic all the way through, definitely. And welcome to the stream. Um, let me see if I can say that word, say the name right. Mycelanus? Mycelanus? I'm so sorry I mispronounced that wrong, but welcome to the stream. I apologize if you heard earlier, I missed you. Nothing wrong with a little brute forcing, as long as you, you keep having fun. Oh, of course. No, I'm, I'm loving this so far, for sure. Um... Let's just see what I can do here. I mean, I have an idea. Oh, man. Oh, I'm going to run, run into the wall if I do that, though. Uh, well, uh, I don't know. Hold on. <laughs> Not that either. Ah. Uh, I 
the hell was I trying to do in my life there? I had an idea, but then it escaped me. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, <laughs> is this it? Okay. Okay. I died. I got an idea. This one will work, though. I'm like Dutch Vanderlyn. I got an idea. I can't do his voice. You know what's funny? I was just watching a video. Ooh, there we go. I was watching a video today of Rob Weedoff. Weed -off. We are, I can't say his name. He's the guy who talks for John Marston. What's funny is the voice actor, he, it's legit his voice. So anytime Rob talks, it's John Marston talking. Turns out that the guy who talks for Dutch, uh, Brian something Davis, the dude, when he talks, it's Dutch. It's insane. And, and this guy, he's a big guy. He's tall and uh, pretty hefty. It's just, it's like, wow, that's awesome. I have some damn faith there. <laughs> Oh, Dutch. Damn it, Dutch. <clears throat> Alright. Now, let me catch up with chat really quick before I keep going a little bit. Assist mode should be, on should be used only if you really can't beat this game on your own. Which, I think it's safe to say I can beat the game on my own. I mean, I'm on Chapter 5 so far. I'm handling it. So, it lets you do things like lower game speed, increase the number of dashes, make you invulnerable to spikes, etc. Doing so disables achievements for a file, though. Oh. But that's pretty cool. I mean, Sysmo, I mean, it helps out. It makes you still enjoy the game. Oh, man. Can't wait to play that later. Right. You know, I was watching a little bit of the stream yesterday. I was just lurking. But I, I still missed a, quite a good chunk because I... Unfortunately, I fell asleep, and I'm like, oh, damn it. But I, I love Red Dead Redemption. Like, it, it, I legit makes you feel like a cowboy. Hey, break this for me. Oops. Am I even supposed to be able to do this? I need light. All right, hold on. Hold the horses. Hold all the horses here. Hi. There was before. Break that for me, I guess. Come up here. No, you can't bother me. Oh, crap. No. Never mind. Wait, I'm looking it up. It looks like this may have been changed in recent months. That's extremely disappointing, if true. Kind of validates the actual achievements. I guess you get the stamp on your file, at least, which you can't remove. Oh. Nope. Why did I do that? Damn, where the hell does this key go? Isn't that the bubble I, I eventually need? Hold on. Okay, 
Key stays. That's good. Ow. Key stays. That's good. Whee! Ow. Okay. All right. That solved all that. Now it's just the idea of, uh, wait, actually shouldn't have done that. It's the idea of that bubble and the strawberry right here. If I go back here, does it kind of let me, like the key's right here. Hmm. This is the bubble that lets me shoot across. Oh! So it takes care of that. Now this will let me shoot across and I should get to the other area, yeah? Go screw yourself, game. Surprised I survived that. Oh! And of course I just died. Uh... I feel like there's areas I'm still missing, you know? Because up there is where I came out from before, yeah? No? That's weird. No, there was a little air. Did, oh, did it get blocked off? I think right here. So I could have sworn this was the same vantage point. Will I play Cadence of Hyrule next? I have no plans to do so. I don't even own the game, and frankly, I I won't pick up the game unless it, it, it gets a little bit cheaper. Not to say it's not worth the twenty-five dollars at all or nothing like that. It's just. Uh, ooh. I wasn't. Ooh, damn. I was expecting it to be oh, like 20 bucks, 15, whatever. So I'll pick it up eventually. Just no plans for it yet. So I need the other key. Did I examine everything I could have? I feel like I haven't. Where did I come from? <laughs> Where? No, I, I got. No, I was here. I did that. What was down here? Oh, I can't. I can't remember if I did this or not. I'm gonna say I didn't do this. Oh. Ow. Hey there, Binks. Welcome to the chat and the stream. How are you doing? Wait, what do I do with my life there, right? Oh, did I have to go the other direction? another key. Well, how the fudge do I get the other key? All right, last off. Need 
Another key, okay. Oh, hi, sir. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. oh. You're doing well, you slept a lot, but I'm still sleeping for some reason. Oh yeah, after what I, I saw you beat the trial in V3 yesterday, so I can only imagine that you are exhausted. Another douchebag. Uh, uh oh, uh oh. Nothing else, okay. Uh, it's gonna be a little funky. Oh, that's weird. It's like I phased. I'm the break is it up there Ooh. oh man okay you really want to get in voice chat later and for those who want my opinion of e3 they can join so I don't have to repeat myself for a bunch of times I would definitely enjoy doing so if I had the time, because uh, I just imagine everything. Okay, let's do this correct this time. That's not correct. Ahaha. No, okay. Well, this isn't creepy at all. Oh, Theo! I found you! Well, I knew you'd make it. It wasn't easy. Are those monsters really coming from inside me? Madeline, that's a valid question. I'll be happy to discuss how the monsters relate to your inner self. Uh, but right now, my inner self is real sick of being stuck inside this crystal. Oh, right. Don't worry, I'll break you out. Well, this is a solid start, but... This crystal's like an expression of my negative psychic energy. Or whatever. Yeah, but how do we break it? If I knew why I trapped myself in this thing, maybe I could bust out. But I don't. And I don't think I can get to the bottom of it while we're stuck in this nightmare nightmare dimension. I hate to say it, but you might have to... Theo, don't even think about that. I am not leaving you behind. Hell no, you better not leave me in this place. I was gonna say, you might have to carry me. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I can do that. Oh, dang, girl, you can lift. <laughs> okay, that's that's great. Oh, that's so great. I can't, I can't dash while I'm carrying Theo, but that's a little bit new mechanic here. Oh man, this is great. All right, you got this. Oh, 
Okay. Gotta go around. Boop. Crushing it. That door didn't stand a chance. Uh oh. I hope you know how to deal with these things. I can. Can I throw them at you? Can I throw them at you? Or you at them, I should say. Oh, you know what? It's fine. <sighs> oh, crap. Let's go for you. Another one? Come on. Alright. I can spring him up. Ah! Uh -huh. Oh crap, the thing was up there. I'm missing a big time now. I can kinda hit him with it, but it doesn't really do much. Okay, come on. Oh no no Theo Why I why did I jump? I didn't need to jump, I just threw him, that's it. After all that hard work I still get destroyed. Okay. Just Son of a... It's like the basic mechanics I'm... I'm forgetting now. Okay. No, no, no! Oh, what the hell happened there? Okay. Thank you. A lot longer than it should have taken me. Okay, so Theo's actually good to... We're good, we're good. Come on, get out, get out, get out. Okay. I'm helping! <laughs> He's so happy about helping. Uh... Okay! Damn it! I... I saw the switch, but him, the monster... Coming back to life pushed me into this room. So I I miss strawberries. It, it's it's okay. Uh okay, I know what to do here. So, there you go. Theo saves the day again. I I can say I play for story as well. I just I think it more so depends. I mean if the if the gameplay is great too, then you know, more to marry her. You know, was, oh. Okay, that was easy enough. Uh oh. Oh, guys, guys, hold on really quick. I'll be right back.
Sorry, guys. I'm doing some technical work right here. Uh, phone. Not my phone. It's not, it's not my phone. It's not working. I'm trying to fix another phone. Why is there no Wi-Fi on this thing? Who's here? Why are, why is everybody in my room? Why are there dogs in here? Everybody ugh. Oh. Come on. I need you to do Wi-Fi. I'm trying to stream. Sorry about that, guys. I did what I had to do. Um, all right, Super Trump, thank you so much for coming out, buddy. I definitely do appreciate it. Yeah, I don't know. Like When games have like an easy mode, I don't know if I would say it's more mockery. I guess it depends on the game. Like, if it's like, if that's how it makes you feel. But other times, I feel like the developers, they mean well. Um, but it's like, okay, this game's that. This is actually giving them a hard time. You know, maybe we can just... I hate saying dumb it down, but like just make it easier for them so they actually can enjoy this uh, experience, you know? So, I don't know. But some games actively mock you for selecting easy mode. And once again, join. I think depends yeah, on what type of game is it. You know, because I feel like, yeah, games will make you... Like, I know, like, with the Deadpool, I think Binks mentioned earlier, that will make fun of you, because, like, oh, you're a baby, you know? That, that's stupid. But, like, it's because of the humor of the game. Now, if, if a game that isn't meant to be funny, and, it, like, it makes you say, like, hey, we noticed that you died a lot and you suck. Here, here's easy. I don't think that's what they necessarily mean, but, you know, people can take it like that. And at Wolfenstein, it does have a baby mode, and it shows BJ Blazkowicz in a, in a bib, once again, it's the humor of it, but yeah, I get you. All right, let's continue. Cause I gotta take a break. I think we're almost done here. Did he do that? Oh. This is gonna be a little bit of a weird one. No, crap. Ugh, damn it. Oh. So if Theo dies, I die. I I get you game. Mm. Damn it. Uh I got it. I thought, like, you know, I had to put him in the edge of this so when it when it hit the right edge, he'll hop up, but I got it. Doggles are good. We had to be we had to be close, I can feel it. Red Dead 2 has a skip option for missions. They have a skip option? Damn, I did not know that. Even even if I was having a hard time with Red Dead, I would I personally wouldn't want to use a skip option because it's like there's you're missing story, in my opinion. Unless they're like, you know, miscellaneous things, but I, I still wouldn't want to miss the experience of the game. I think there's a lot more in that room I, I just totally missed, but it's fine. Uh oh. The hell's that? What the hell's pushing me like that? I mean, I, I see the ripple, but, like, what's doing it? Okay. Eat 
Theo Crystal. Somehow that worked to actually break him out of the crystal. <laughs> okay. A few things I love in this image. One, look at the determination on Madeline's face. But she is so small compared to Theo. And look like he just got drapes over her. But look, look how well she's doing this. This is great. And he still has his damn phone clenched in his right hand. Like, he's he's exhausted, but that phone, it is not going anywhere. Theo's great. And Madeline, she's, she's a sweetheart. So if you die or fall, fail like four times in a mission, they let you skip to the next checkpoint. I had to use it for a bounty last night. Oh, man. I don't, I don't recall. I could have sworn I died a bunch of times in a couple of missions, but oh well. That phone's probably expensive. Yeah, right. Ah, thirty-one. B-side. Can't even imagine what B-side looks like. All right, so. Mission six. It looks like we're almost done, guys. So we're on mission six or chapter six. However, I am going to take a break because it's been a little more than an hour. And uh, damn, what the hell is right? Two thirty. What the hell? What time did I start? I've been streaming for two hours. What the fudge? And okay, never mind. It's fine. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take a break. Be back in like three to five minutes. Get up, stretch, eat, do what you got to do. We'll come back. We'll start chapter six and um, see what else, is, what this game has for us. So see you guys in a little bit.